Hello and welcome back to the channel. We are continuing our playthrough of Fallout 4. In the last episode, we uncovered a medical malpractice murder, basically, where uh, somebody went in for a facial reconstruction surgery and ended up not walking out alive. That is all taken care of, though, so we are ready to move on to new and better things. So, um, I think the biggest thing we're trying to do is we're trying to do this Dangerous Minds quest where we go and talk to Dr. Amari, but we got a couple of things we need to visit along the way <clears throat> while we do that. So, we're going to walk outside and start figuring out where we're going. I probably didn't even need to go outside either. Because now I'm going to have to load twice. That sucks. I didn't think about that. But we'll get outside, we'll check the map, and then we'll fast travel as far over the over in the direction that we need to go as we can. It just kind of depends. Let's see, on the map, we need to get to... So that's the Gilded Grasshopper one, that's the Dr. Amari one, and then we still need to go and do this combat zone. But at the same time, we also need... There was also... Um, I think we should go back over to... I think is it this one because we need to follow that freedom trail to figure out where that's going because that's another quest we have on our list but for whatever reason the marker is not bringing it up on the map so we'll travel over there real quick we'll follow the pit we'll follow the pathway for that and then see what happens Hmm. I don't remember. Okay. Decided I was just going to go ahead and hide my taskbar so I could actually see because. When I'm walking around normally, the compass at the bottom is high enough that it clears my taskbar because I play in windowed mode so I can see my recording off to the side. But uh, when I'm in this, when I'm in the power armor, again, they put the compass all the way at the bottom so you can't see anything. Uh, so across this, way, well, we gotta. Are these enemies. Very satisfying to just walk up and start smashing people with a hammer. <laughs> not planning on making I'm not planning on making melee my primary skill or anything. It's just, you know, sometimes you just want to. So okay, we gotta. So the the goal is is we gotta follow this little brick path or red path or whatever you want to call it. I just wasn't sure if they were enemies, so I walked up to them just to see because they weren't reacting and they were just kind of standing there waiting for me to, I guess, waiting for me to do something. Oh, Are they coming out? Come on, bullet time, please. Thank you. Missed him. Okay, not too bad. Bottle cap and a gold watch. Very nice. I mean, if they're gonna give me free bottle caps, give it to me. Two and A. Oh, okay, I remember that, Never mind. We have to pay attention to those as we go, but I remember what that's for, so. It doesn't matter if we miss them. Mm, okay. Oh, I always get lost here. <clears throat> it looks like it turns to the left, I think. I hear something. Uh, out there. Come. Another one? Ow. 
What's shooting me? I don't think we're... What is shooting me? Okay... A lot of dead bodies over here. Mongrel dog meat. It's kind of funny that you have a dog named dog meat and then you can find a mongrel dog meat. What is it? I don't know if a radioactive gland is going to be so something I can use. Now. Sweet. Okay, it's all experience points. 44 rounds, and uh, I'm just going to take everything. It takes too long to sift through it that way. I don't really want to go through this building, but they went out of their way to attack me, so now I'm kind of like, eh. Oh, and then we do that. Nah, I'm not going back up there again. Let's get back out here and start following this path. We got other things to do. I think it turned this way. But I always get lost when I'm following this trail because I think they intentionally went out of their way. Oh, there it is. They intentionally went out of their way to make it convoluted and stupid. Well, that's where we need to go for the main quest that we're doing, but I would like to continue following this while we're here. Just kind of get it done and out of the way. Okay. Oh, there's a box over here. Never would have noticed that if I hadn't... Oh! Well, they got me. Mm, getting the feeling that this is not the right direction. I don't see any red anywhere. Oh. Let's switch to our sniper rifle. Am I able to... Lucky and hit him in the head. I'm a big fan of sniping. Okay. Doesn't seem like anyone else is coming, so let's swap into... Oh, there it is. Wasn't sure if this was the direction we needed to go, but it is. Okay, I don't see anything else. I hear shots going off, but... Is that Valentine fighting something over here? Of course he is. Oh. Oh, okay, I got I got the solution for this. Yeah, how about that? Okay, I'll pick you back up. Pick 
a stim, stim pack. Why not? Okay, let's see what they had in their camp over here. We ended up killing them, so we might as well take their stuff. There is a trap right there. The box over here. No, I don't want any bloat fly meat. That's disgusting. No, thank you. But we'll take all the circuitry and stuff from this guy and find out what they had over here. Okay, no. Not really trying to go inside of any buildings at the moment. I guess that's it. All right, so we'll head back over towards the path that we were following. So I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to reassign my stuff because my instinct is to want to go long to short. So we'll make that number two. We'll make the sniper rifle number one. And hopefully I can just I'll just get in the habit of pressing of remembering range is what's deciding things here. Dude, I'm shooting him in the face. I'm not sure what the deal with that was. That was annoying. Okay, seriously, I, can the can this thing turn off? I'm gonna need to look that up because that's it's really frustrating when the bullet time won't turn off. Cool thing is, is that all the the energy weapons that I have all use the same ammo. So the ammo I have is the ammo I have. Oh, here we go. Yeah, human, human, human. Got a treat for you. He went inside. Yes, we're not alone. Ah, manual. Oh. Cradle of love. Where is this guy? Oh. Someone's coming. Okay. <coughs> Excuse me. I think we're good. Okay, I'm gonna switch to the medium range weapon now because we're getting into kind of sort of close quarters. Okay. I think we're doing okay. I know I could shoot a little better, but kind of is what it is. Let's get inside of here because I know there's a quest in here. Or at least there should be. Yeah, there's a quest in here. Oh. Okay, and I have that, I have the stim pack bound to my number four key, so that makes that easy to access. I don't have to go in the menu for it anymore. Dude. Okay, I don't need a tibia. Hate 
hate it when they do that. Take their bottle caps. Can't go down there. Good fight, human! You'll die well! Hmm. Where'd you go? Huh? Gonna find you? Gonna kill you! I'll take all of that. Taste. You're not going to do anything. Uh, I think they're going to have to form the deposit. Okay. Don't. It's like I want to use the bullet time mod, but it, the inconsistency of activating and deactivating it is more irritating than just killing the damn things. It's great when it works, but it sucks. It sucks hard when it doesn't. Uh, okay. I know I'd have a lot more rounds available to me if I didn't have to shoot if I was able to like slow things down and shoot much more accurately but smashers, smashers. that would have been a perfect case to use my sledgehammer matter of fact why don't we switch to that now if I'm going to use my AP I might as well use it running into melee range to get these dudes oh, there's the alarm clock Oh crap. There goes my armor. Sooner or later. Die, metal man. Okay. How many stim packs did I use? <laughs> Jeez, man. Oh, we got some fusion cells out of that. Tactical boosted laser rifle. What does that mean? Tactical boosted laser rifle. Has a 78 damage versus my... 71. Fire... Hold on. Fire rate of 93. Hmm. Well, let's look at it first. Tactical boosted. Hmm. So hold on. So it's what? 78, 69, and 203 versus 71, 93, and 101. Hmm. Kind of torn, actually. Why don't we use this for a little bit and see how it goes? Of course, we're not going to get a chance to really do anything with it because it killed everything here, but whatever. We really need to go back and repair the armor because the grenades really messed us up. <laughs> that was not cool. Of 
course we're going outside, so that requires a massive loading segment. <sighs> Come on. You can do it. You can do it. Wow, this one's taking a long time. That was like a lot. That was a lot. Okay, so we'll take his bottle caps. Take the duct tape. We'll take the oh, yeah. grasshopper. Read food for the grasshopper. Is it in data? Okay, and then we have to just, we have to, we're supposed to find a grave nearby, I think. But before we try to go do that, we're going to run back to uh, Sanctuary and use the armor, the armor dealio there to heal ourselves. And then I think that's probably going to go ahead and be it for this episode. So hopefully you guys are having lots of fun. Be sure to click that like button so the YouTube algorithm knows that you are. Subscribe to the channel so you know when the next video comes out. And I do have a link to my Patreon in the description if you'd like to help me turn this channel into a thriving online business. Again, thank you very much for your time. And I'll see you next week.